Greetings from Kigali. I'm actually standing on our front yard right now, and interestingly enough, I'm standing in front of a poinsettia, which is a little bit bigger than what we're used to seeing back in Kelowna. It's been a great blessing that we could be at this house right now. We just moved in a couple of days ago, and God has uh, provided for us in a tremendous way. We now have our container here. Uh, it took two months instead of four to six months, which we were expecting. So it's all unpacked now. We've moved everything into the house. There's still a few boxes around. Uh, but we're just so thankful that we can be in our house before Christmas. It's a great Christmas present. And our vehicle is here too, and uh, we couldn't be happier right now. God has just been so uh, faithful to us and to answer our prayers. Just want to wish you a Merry Christmas on behalf of our family. Uh, and also a great new year. God has been so good to us, and I just pray that you will also experience the goodness of God in 2010. Uh, we've been so busy since we've been here uh, for three months now. It's almost been exactly three months. Allison and Sydney are adjusting extremely well to school. It's been, uh, it's been quite an adjustment for them, but God has been faithful as well. And uh, Actually, the house that we're in right now, the one that we just moved into, is only 500 meters away from the school, which is virtually across the street. They start again in January. They're on a bit of a break now. The school years run from January to November. Caitlin and Margaret have been helping out at church. They've actually been developing a, a kids a church program and they've been working steadily at that and they're actually again on a bit of a Christmas break from that so they start up again in January. I've been pretty busy with music ministry and doing quite a bit of preaching while uh, Elmer and Cherry Comont have been away in India on, a, on another missions trip. Our church actually has missionaries in India if you can believe it. Uh, it's, it there's quite a story behind that maybe some other time we'll have a chance to share that with you. We're just really thankful for what God is doing here in Kigali and we're looking forward to an amazing uh, 2010 uh, as we continue to adjust. But one thing that we have found for sure is that God is faithful and He will continue to be faithful. So God bless you back home and uh, we just pray that you will just continue to keep us in your thoughts and in your prayers and also your financial support. We can't do this without you and uh, we continue to look forward to what God is doing and also reporting back to you some of the pr prayers that have been answered. So God bless you all.